Alright, first things first, I want to thank you guys for all the love you guys put and gave and commented and liked and all. Uh, it, the last Genshin video did super well, and I loved replying and reading all your guys' comments. I try to reply to all of them, and so that's kind of how I want to begin this video is by addressing the three main things I saw. So number one was talking about domains and stuff like that and how to unlock characters. I haven't gone through all the menus yet. I have like pimped out my profile a bit, but I haven't gone archive. Huh? Oh, I think these are tutorials and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Whoa, that's cool. I have a little, a little book full of all of the little things I got. It's like a little, that's awesome. Okay. Well, that wasn't exactly what I was thinking of, like, what I was trying to get at, but that's cool that we got a little, a little sidetrack there. That's awesome. Where are the lizards that I killed? Yeah, here are the lizards I took last episode. Okay. That's besides the point. Um, something about domains and characters and stuff like that. I don't know how to access that stuff. I haven't gotten any notification to like, hey, check out this domain to unlock this character. So I'm assuming that, that I'll get a tutorial about that later. So maybe it'll happen in this part, maybe it'll be part three, I don't know. Second thing I wanted to address are the artifacts, which I... Someone commented and gave me a very helpful tutorial. I'll put the com I'll put all the comments up on screen. Yeah, I'll put... This is the first comment I remember seeing about artifacts. So if I go into character, is that where I go? Yeah. So it, it was very helpful in regards to, like, sets. I don't... I still don't understand what sets mean but i'm equip that because it's the best one <laughs> maybe it's like the prefix is it so like anything that starts with the adventurer's fe tail feather and adventurer's bandana i think maybe it's the adventurer suffix that kind of creates the, a stack effect so i'll give the adventurer's watch to to aether then yeah that's the second thing i want to address third thing is that i was right there was something there was a chest at um at the beginning area. I just drowned before I could get there. So we're going to go after that. Before exploring Mondstadt. Which actually just reminded me of another thing I wanted to talk about. I was always going to explore Mondstadt in part 2. I just didn't want to make part 1 overly long by exploring Mondstadt in that. If that makes sense. So I was saving it for this episode. Not saving the exploration for off camera. Don't worry. I never. It was always the plan to show you guys my full reaction to everything. Another another thing. That I'm now reminding of is that someone commented to talk about Timmy and to talk to Timmy again. So I want to do that. <laughs> Timmy. <laughs> What's up? Oh, that's I pressed the wrong button. Ah. They'll be maybe if I do a different dialogue option, they'll be back. They do come back usually, but what happens if one day they leave and never come back again? Just like that. Oh. Wait, can I? Can, is there? Can I like respond to him about that? Aw, oh, man. Wait, did I scare the pigeons away the second time I went down this bridge? Was I supposed to not scare them away and I would have unlocked another option with them? Okay, so I don't know how... I don't know how far I have to walk to get to the beach. Aren't there those, like, way shrines I can take? I think there are. Would it be by Starfell Lake? Oh, I could teleport straight from the map. Okay. I was about to be like, that's about to be a bit of a hike if I have to walk all the way. Okay. This is not where I started. Oh, I recall now. Okay, there's this little blubbling slime right here. I'm getting good at this. Oh. Oh, yeah. Another, some, uh, someone else commented about the elements and how it helps. So, basically, I think everything is strong against everything was what that impl comment was implying. Which is why it's telling me Amber should use her arrows which i don't really know what it wants me to use it on the thing's dead i think it's just telling me it's charged up i don't know oh wait there's a chest right there not even to the secret chest yet and we're already getting getting banked pop this bad boy open a reward on the road ain't that the truth son i honestly don't even remember where i even i don't remember where i dropped off from from oh wait i see now i see where we're going i remember this i see a pathway I'm going to follow the pathway. This is the tutorial area, so I'd imagine I've lost the path. Oh, no. Is that a squirrel? Can I kill the squirrel? Oh, I feel bad. See, I got to stop killing the creatures because I felt bad when I killed the fox earlier. And I also got, and now I'm sad because I just killed the squirrel. And that squirrel was just living his life, but it's whatever. I'll take this mushroom. Do I have to climb up here? Ha! 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 Oh, wait, I forgot. You can climb up. 
the sides of walls. I don't like the angle I'm climbing at. Aether, you better hold on tight, bro. If you fall... Okay, <laughs> I was like... <laughs> I was so nervous there for a sec. Wow! Wow, this clearing is very beautiful. <gasps> it's a shame I'll probably never go here again. Was that a waypoint right there I could have teleported to? It was. Okay, well, you know, I'm glad we went down this journey anyway. Here we are. Okay, so I am 90% sure it's where I drowned in the first episode. So I am, I gotta go there. And I gotta see, I got. I got. I have to. I cannot believe I was right, but I drowned before I could prove it, you know? <laughs> I was, I, I, damn. That's so funny though. <laughs> that's actually really, really funny. How that's the secret was like right there. Okay, so if my memory serves me correctly, here's where I drowned. I just gotta be careful and watch the, my energy. Which should be easy. Okay, let's regen here. Splash! Alright, if I can swim over to this rock. Storm bearer point, highly dangerous. Nuh uh. Oh, wait, it's kind of flat here. Is this where the chest is? I can't swim all the way to that island, can I? No, there's no way the secret's on that island. I refuse to believe that. Oh, no, I'm losing, I'm losing, I'm losing, I'm losing, I'm losing it. I'm losing. No, 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 let me swim, please, please. No! Okay. That's tough, man. Am I on the wrong... Am I on the wrong rock island? Oh, nah, because now I'm gonna get comments about this, too. They're gonna be like, oh, you dumbass. You missed the other... <laughs> you missed the... You missed the other secret chest. Oh, no, it's up here. It's gotta be. I refuse to believe otherwise. Okay, if I climb up here, maybe? Oh, there's no shot. There is simply... Yeah, there's no shot. Oh, is it that island over there? Nice swan dive, Aether. Oh, it's gotta be. It can't be anything else. There it is! There's the chest! Oh, yeah! Okay, that is so comfortable. Comfortable? I was gonna say comforting, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, let's do it. Oh, damn it, I just wasted... I just wasted stamina. Okay, Aether, swim like your life depends on it, man. Because it does, you're gonna drown. No, 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 no. I can make it to this rock. No, dude, are you pooping me right now? Just have to swim slowly. If I stop swimming in the middle of it, will I regain energy? By staying, like, still in the water? Oh, no, I, I lose energy. Ah, what the hell? Aether, please, please, I need this. I need it! Dude! Okay, hold on. I think I'm... Uh, I think I'm starting from the wrong spot. How far can I walk into the water without swimming? Okay, that's how far I can walk without... Okay. Swim back to standing, Aether. Okay, so it's right, like, right here. So I gotta conserve as much energy as possible by not swimming. Okay, now go for it. I can stand on that rock to regain my strength. Yeah, this feels a lot more feasible. Oh, come on, dude. Really? It's, it can't be that hard, Aether. Come on, man. Wait, I'm doing this all wrong. So I was thinking, like, okay, where, how far can I walk into it without drowning? But that rock right here, the rock right here is closer to the rock right there. So if I do the strat I was using there to this rock, I can jump. Hold on, I messed it up already. But I can jump to the rock like, from the rock to the other rock, and then get the chest. Alright. Round two, let's do this. Bro, is he dead? Aether died by drowning too much? Okay, just eat an egg or something, then. Damn. Does Amber have higher energy? Oh, that could be it. Maybe characters have different staminas? That might be the case. Wait! Yeah, okay, Amber has higher stamina. There's a little edge on that rock there, too. So if I time it correctly, do everything right, I might be able to get that chest. All right, Amber, I believe in you. You know, I know everyone hates Amber. Well, actually, no, the comments are very... Are you kidding me, Amber? Is he dead again? Oh my god, Aether's dead again. I don't know how to get there. Is there, like, an item I'm not aware of? Is that something I could fix? Character. Is there, like, a way to... 
Yeah, there is a max stamina, so I'd have to get our, my stamina up. If I level them up, could I? Oh, I see. Okay, stop making those sounds, man. I see level up. Okay. So I could either use this or that. I don't really know what one does more, but I'll use this one. I have nine of them. So I'll level, I'll level you up to five. Does that not increase your... Did your stamina not increase at all? It didn't. Then what was the point? <laughs> Wait, what? Man... I went back here for nothing. I don't know how to get that. Oh, that's a, that's so saddening, dude. That makes me so sad. Genshin, you're making me sad. Oh, ocean crab. I want it. No, because I don't have the ocean crab yet. Let's go. Because I, after I saw... What was it? It was like archive. Yeah. In the archive, there is everything in here. And in living beings, there, there are like different types of crabs. Yeah, there's ocean crab and golden crab. I want every crab possible. All the cra all of these. I want to fill this whole thing out. Does that make does that weird? Is that weird to say? I mean, I feel like it might be. Like, but like, I don't know. I just I'm a big. I love collecting things like that. Like in video games. Like, I I, I just. Where's the map? I'm just wowed by the amount of stuff in this game. Like the sheer amount of content in this game is just awesome to me. But yeah, I'm feeling pretty sad. I didn't get a chance to get that forsaken chest. So, I guess comment down below. Did I do something wrong? Like, is le does leveling up not change your stamina? Is this just, like, something that increases over time? Like, it's, like, the more I run as Amber, for example, the more I gain the, s the stamina as Amber. Is that the case? Or is it, like, more arbitrary, where it's just by level? Not arbitrary, but more, like, level by level. Again, I read all the comments. So, any and all advice is more than welcome. Use revival item. Okay, Amber, I guess we're going to the location designated by Amber as Amber. Well, we're gonna, I'm going to explore Mondstadt first because I love the vibes of this city. And I really want to see more of it. I don't even know. Wait, if I go on the map, can I get like a Mondstadt level map? No, okay. I can either go up. Okay, this seems like a dead end. So if I go left, it seems like a dead end. And then right leads me to the next stage of the city. So I'm going to go left first. Whoa. Told you I'd win. Hey, Wagner, can I help you? I'd like something made. What do you have to sell? I'd like to ask, yeah, I'd like to ask you about something. How good is this smithy? Stupid question. If you really want to know, buy something. Talk is cheap. Pick up a blade and soon, and you'll soon know. Even if this much eludes you, then you got a long road ahead of you, runt. Okay, you know what? I'm not taking that, personally. Hey, Schultz, how'd you feel about taking over the business? Boom! <laughs> Go, go, Baron Bunny! Blew him up! <laughs> Tell me about yourself. There are no other qualified blacksmiths here except for me and my apprentice, Schultz. Schultz? Oh, it's not Schultz, it's Schultz. I can tell you from experience that hard work is all there is to the craft. Many other blacksmiths out there are just there to make a quick mora. Family? Inheritance? Meaningless. I only need an apprentice to pass on my skills. Alright. He's just a no-nonsense blacksmith. That's fair enough. Uh, I'd like something made then? Did you bring the materials? Let me have a look. I see. I don't have- I don't think I have any- I don't think I have enough for anything. Oh, enchantment ore! Yeah, let's make two enchantment ores. Yeah! Alright, Schultz, what do you got? Looking to buy a weapon? You should talk to Wagner. Uh, what are you doing? I'm an apprentice named Schultz. Master's work is pure perfection. I never tire of watching him work. I wish he helped Master out with odd jobs on the shop floor. Getting some downtime where I can just watch him work his magic is reward enough for me. Any of your own masterpieces to show me? I have tried. The results are usually less than perfect, though. Master normally melts them back down and redoes them. There was this one I was quite proud of, but Master wouldn't let me sell it from his shop. Said it damaged his reputation. So I took it out to the side gate and gave it a few swings. I ended up sticking it in the ground there. There's a group of kids who hang out over there. Seems to have got them interested. Anyway, I digress. Oh, I gotta check out the sword. Wait, so he swung it outside the gates? And kids hang out there. Okay, I gotta go I gotta go find it. Uh hi Sage. Hey ya! Okay, that's cool. Hey there, kiddo. Hmm. So you've heard of the Dandelion Sea? Dan I, no, I can't say I have. Uh-huh, there's this book I've read. It says that somewhere in Mondstadt, there's a big sea of dandelions. It even has little talking foxes in it. Talking foxes? Yup, I wanna know what what talking to animals is like. But I've only seen a guy in green clothes and white socks talk to animals before. Happened to bump into him. 
I told mom how awesome he was, but that but that guy said I was mistaken. Are these your parents? Parsley and rosemary? Alright, got the herbs and spices over there. We can't go on like this. This dandelion sea, there's no way to find it, is there? It's a fairy tale, a fantasy. But should I tell him, or shouldn't I? That may be so, but humans can never leave their fantasies aside. Only if we can dream, we have hope, and with hope comes opportunity. Surely you haven't forgotten that snowy day in Snezhena, when you were my boar princess and I was your wolf pup? Huh? Yo, yo, I'm right here, yo! <laughs> Parsley, just as we once dreamed to ascend to Celestia, no, even now we, indeed, even for another moment, let's allow little Sage to enjoy the fantasies of his youth. I, oh, I forget it. I didn't mean to send out Baron Bunny. Hey, uh, how are you fine? How are you gonna enjoy your final moments? <laughs> Why was I out here again? Oh yeah, the sword. There's a. There should be a sword out here. That shining is that it? No, it's just a mushroom. You know, maybe I should ask him where outside the city Robert's gates he left there. it, because I'm kind of just lost. <laughs> oh, all right, sweet. I had to talk to him to attain that. Okay. What's your name? Scholes. Scholes? Um, what are you doing? Can I get, like, is there a dialogue option? So I took it out the side gate and gave it- Oh, side gate! Okay, so it was a side gate, so I didn't have to go outside. Let's check the map. Where's the side gate? There it is! Okay, when I'm over at that area, I'll go out there and check out the sword. Alright, about your master. You'll have spoken to Wagner before, I'm sure. Bit curt, yeah? I'd be hard-pressed to find a better mentor, though. Let's look at the weapons he makes. A true testament to how hard he works. As long as there's mutual respect between us, I can't ask for more. To be honest, I think Master would get lonely without me here. Last time I took a trip back home, for example. Actually, never mind. Yeah, don't bring that one up with Master. Can we bring that one up with Master real quick? Hey, yo, Wagner. What happened at that trip? I'd like to ask about something. Alright, never mind. I can't. Gonna, I saw something shiny up here. Yeah, is that, a, is that a pineapple? Like a pineapple slice? Oh, no, it's one of them lifesaver gummies. Oh, a Radiant Spin Crystal? Wow. If y'all want me to do a reading video where I read all of these little things, because I want to look through all of this. There's lore for every single item we have. And I want to read all of it. I really do. So I might do a video where I just... Reading everything in Genshin for the first time, I guess. Can I go inside these buildings? Okay, no. Okay, does this lead? This leads me to the upper level of the city, right? This used to be a bustling street, but with so many storm terror attacks recently, the usual crowds are nowhere to be seen. Except for the local tavern near the city wall over there. They haven't been affected. If anything, their business is better than ever. Uh huh. Thank you for sharing, Amber. Let's. Okay, I don't think there's anything else to check down here then, right? Why is that door glowing? Damn door. This door seems to be locked by a curious seal. I wonder whose place this is. That kind of looks like something of the animo. Can I... Can I use my animal power to break it open? No, I can't. Oh, kitty cat! I don't know if my mic is picking up. I'm sorry, 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 I'm sorry. Can I pet? There's no pet button? I'm sorry, buddy. Man, fuck. there are so many ways in and out of the city, man. Oh, whoa, what's up here? Adventurers Guild? Hi, Jack. Hey, are you a new adventurer? Want to join my adventure team? Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, people here usually band together in groups of four to go on adventures. You seem to be in good company. I once belonged to a rather nice team, but unlucky Bennett was also there. I've heard about Bennett in the comments. Okay. I heard he's actually OP, actually, so I should bring him on for missions. We all thought it was just a joke about him being unlucky, but all the commissions he took on somehow always failed in the least expected way. Come to think of it, it is rather strange. Are it's you a good day you, to go gliding? So you don't want to go on an adventure with me? Okay, bye. Yo, Cyrus, what you got? Hey, Gitto! Welcome to the Adventurers Guild. Who are you? I'm Cyrus, adventurer of the. Adventure of the Adventurers Guild? Really, dude? I'm Cyrus, master of the Adventurers Guild, Mondstadt branch. I'm sure we'll get to know each other later on. I can tell you are a born adventurer. How can I tell? 
Just to call it as a just call it a senior adventurer's hunch. <laughs> Listen, if you're interested, we could talk about it more at Angel's Share another day. Can you share some adventurer's experience with me? Why, of course. Here, take this. I'm sure it'll be of use to you. To put it plainly, you'll need to remember two words. Courage and perseverance. Thanks, man. Oh, adventurous experience. Got it. I'm assuming that's something I use to level up. Right, I'm also going to be your gardener adventurous <laughs> guild. I got a feeling you're hiding something in these bushes that I need to be aware of. So, they weren't hiding anything in the bushes. Can I go inside then? No, I can't. I can climb on top. Wait. Are there chests on the rooftops? <laughs> oh no. Okay, I gotta wait to regen my health. But if I can climb all the way up there. <laughs> Please! Oh, I gotta see what's up there now. Okay, so if I climb all the way to the top and then rest on this balcony right here. Aether, fall on the balcony! Fall on the balcony! Fall on the balcony! Please! Okay, we're good. Never mind. Whoa! Wow! Yo, Aether, this spike could really mess you, <laughs> really mess you up right now, dude. Be careful. Oh, there's a whole village over there. Oh god. Oh, there's a whole village over there. Little boat thing right here. Wow. This is beautiful. All right, time to take the plunge down. Wait, if I jump from here to the balcony. Oh. Oh, I lived. All right, that's good. Okay, so we kind of went out of order, a tad bit. So let's go back to where we started, because I wanted to go... So left ended at a dead end, but it kind of didn't, so that sucked. Well, they didn't suck at all. That was fun. <laughs> I like going down there, but I also want to see what's down here. Welcome to Floral Whisper. Do you need anything? Flowers, yeah. Let's get one of each. I could talk to all these guys. Man, there's a lot of lore. Only fresh fruit at Quinn's Fruit. Okay. Quinn? Oh, it's you again. What will we have today? Just a reminder, no discounts. Oh, she's pretty. I like her. Honestly, they both are- Every character in this game is gorgeous, bro. Not even for a friend. I've said this before and I'll say it again. No discounts on the goods because they're worth the price. Oh, come on. What if I bring you lunch? No discounts. No matter what you say. Okay, Quinn. I don't trust you. Bruce? What's up, Bruce? Hi, hi. Anything the knights can do for you? What are you doing? I was just having a sleep, uh, a sweep. I was doing a sweep, sweeping survey of all the, uh, safety blind spots in Modstat, mm-hmm. Slacking off? No, by no means, not me. Never perish the thought. What a peculiar night. Huh, <sighs> look at me making a fool of myself. In any case, you can't say peace prevails in Mondstadt unless you've got a freeloading, sorry, I mean free-spirited night to show for it. I'm sure my life would have been more interesting if I'd gone to the Adventurer's Guild instead. What makes you say that? Just think. As an adventurer, you get to explore wherever you wanted, literally anywhere in the Seven Nations of Tyvat. And best of all, you can make a living from it. What can be more fun than that? It does sound like a good deal. Exactly. I also feel like the Knights have too serious an air about them for my liking. By comparison, the Adventurer's Guild doesn't have many annoying rules and a lot of interesting people. For example, there's Fischl. I don't understand everything she says, but it sounds really cool. If only I had joined the Adventurers Guild back then, I might even be her partner right now. Ooh, partner? I've even thought something to call myself. Something like the Demon King of Damnation. Sounds cool, right? Yeah, what's the Bruce banner dropping, honestly? I don't know why I decided to take this back street, but it looks cool. There might be more secret chests I don't even know about. There were chests all over the city. All right, we got Patton's Winery. Do I go inside? No. Uh, let's talk to Patton. Come in, come in. We're having a discount at Angel Share. Do you have any specials these days? Currently, we're giving every customer a free chicken mushroom skewer. It goes dr great with any drink. Here, take one and have a seat. I promise it'll suit your liking. Sweet! Nimrod? Who's Nimrod? Oh, you're you Nimrod. Gotta try I take it back, Allie. I shouldn't get caught buying alcohol. Hi, Nimrod. Oh, hi. What's the matter? What are you doing? Is that a trick question? I'm on my way to have a drink. Oh, er, it's fine. I don't think my wife will have overheard that. So I actually had to sneak out to buy some wine. How can you deny a Mondstadter the right to drink? When even one of those four drunkards is a woman, how can my wife be so narrow-minded? Where are the four drunkards? You want to know more about them, eh? <laughs> well, they're nothing short of legends in Mondstadt. I'm part of the Knights of Havonius' Grand Master Varka. I can see you're only pretending to follow. Are you from out of town? No wonder you haven't heard. There's no point in giving you the real names, then. I'll give you your nicknames and see if you can figure it out. They are Sol Dalritz the Oblivious Merchant, Dame Workshy the Absentee Boss, Odir the Incredible Hunter, 
and Rookie McSchoolboy, the inexperienced adventurer. I'm taking a screenshot of this because I feel like I'm going to need this eventually. Is this a quest? I have to figure out who the guys are. That'd be really, that's actually really funny. Should be pretty obvious by now, huh? <laughs> Talk to you later. Dawn Winery Recruitment Guide. I ain't reading all that, but I'll read that later. That's, oh, that's actually really cool that I can just read that up there. I get like the guide. That's awesome. That's Someone commented about how much lore there is in this game, and I'm like, I agree. The love that must have, like, the amount of love it must have taken to make this game is just incredible to me. Ooh, what's this down here? Got Hertha, coordinator of the Knights of Favonius. Homet, what do you need from me? Um, tell me a little bit about yourself. I am the captain of the sixth company in charge of logistics. You can just call me Hertha. My work mostly includes the charter and administration of our baggage train, resource management, and record keeping. But Mondstadt's state is as you have seen. With the Grand Master having taken much of our manpower with him, we have since been in a constant state of shorthandedness. At the same time, our inventory is running a surplus to match, so I'm more than willing to exchange some of it for a little hand here and there. I'm taking all comers who have experience in solving problems. With any luck, we'll have some of... But first, you need to earn everyone's trust, so how about starting a few solvable... Huh? I'm gonna be honest, it was just kind of a whole lot of waffling for me, so I didn't read most of it. Um, but I'm guessing I have to do favors for the city to, like, earn their trust or something? Like, earn more quests, maybe? I don't know. Oh, nice! Wait, can I do that to all these little crates right here? Or was that just, like, a little special one? That was a little special one. Alright. No shot! Bruh! Damn it, did I die again? Yeah, I'm gonna need all, I'm gonna need all this to re resurrect Aether. You see, he keeps dying and drowning. Can I sail these? Please tell me I can sail these. Can I sail these on a little sailboat? No, I can't. Okay. Ooh. Nice. Another, t another teleport waypoint. Okay. So now I can come back here whenever I want. Excellent. All right. That's what I like to see. Now we're here back at the fountain. Okay, so we went down that way, we got the winery. We went down that way, and we got the... Damn it. <laughs> What's it called? Blacksmith, yeah. Which we still need to find that sword, but I feel like that's going to be a bit higher up in the, like, area. You have a diamond. What does that mean? Welcome. Every treasure here is unique, so we don't negotiate on the price. Nor do we give refunds. Okay, I'd like to browse the items then. My, this is unfortunate. Oh. Yeah, town. Haven't you heard? Uh, I'd like to ask about something. Oh, I see you're very interested. Um, how do- do I- did you talk about Wolfendom? I didn't, but did I? Oh, yes. I did see something strange in Wolfendom not long ago. The silhouette, it seemed to be a boy, but he was with a pack of wolves, and they seemed very close, so perhaps I was mistaken. I was quite a distance away, and after all, it was only a glimpse. I mean, how could humans live alongside wolves? How strange. How strange indeed. Sarah the waitress? What do you got? Welcome, good hunter. How can I help you? I'd like to ask about something. Oh, what can I do for you? Tell me, are there any events happening of late? Oh, is this like the... Heard any rumors lately? From like the bartender in Skyrim? There happens to be a salad tasting event going on now. Here you go. If you like it, you can always visit me again. Oh, let's get a salad. Nice! Good hunter is the best restaurant in town. We are famous for our venison steak and satisfying salad. The hunters in Springvale provide us with the ingredients. All ingredients are brought in fresh every day. I can tell you about any item on the menu if you're interested. I'm good. Judging by your looks, you must be Traveler. I should probably have switched to Aether for this in conversation, but whatever. Mondstadt truly is a great place for visitors. Its temperate climate and clean water give birth to the best apples in all of Tavat. Our famous satisfying st She just shoved me out of the way! Rude. Do you want to give it a try? Well, I already have it, so... Yuri, what's your problem, Yuri? Yeah, doesn't feel good, does it? Boom! Sarah, run. Sarah, run. Sarah, run. Sarah, I don't want you to die in this! Oh, I'm gonna, stand, I'm gonna step back. <laughs> Hello, are you looking for anything in particular? I'm looking for answers. Have you seen my alcoholic scoundrel of a husband by chance? Sorry, I wasn't really... I was kind of reading that stuff in my head, but... I always got screwed off to find a drink somewhere. So she is the husband, whoa, it's I mean, she is the wife. wife of the guy down there. Okay, a little dog there. What's up, dog? I won't click, because last time I saw a pet, I actually stabbed it, and I wasn't happy about that. Oh, these crates are too conveniently stacked. 
Hold up. Oh, there's got to be something. Let's go. Okay, there are no chests up here, but there there was has to be some the re, there had to be a reason why those crates were stacked so conveniently. I'm assuming maybe a later quest down the line. That seems like a fair bet. All right. Ouch. Uh Timaeus. Go go Baron Bunny. Hi there. Are you interested in alchemy? Okay, so this guy's the alchemist. Ow. I like to use the crafting bench. Who are you? Yeah, who are you? I am Timaeus, an alchemy scholar. You may not have heard my name before, but I bet you'll have heard the names Albedo and Sucrose before. I have. Those are names I've heard from, like, friends and other people in the community. Because I just... I... Okay. I don't even know how I unlock half these guys, but, you know. Albedo is nothing short of genius in the field of alchemy. And his assistant, Sucrose, is extremely talented for her age. I am a total amateur compared to them. About Albedo. Albedo is an alchemy prodigy. People call him the Kaida Prince. He's the top alchem alchemical talent in Mondstadt. They say he's an outlander who just showed up in Mondstadt one day and was instantly taken on as a chief alchemist by the Knights of Favonius. He's also captain of the investigation team. His alchemical theory is refreshing and unbridled in comparison to conventional theories. In practice, it all works out, too. In his eyes, my work must seem like child's play. Oh, how's your research coming along? Not too bad, although I haven't had the best of luck recently. My clock is a few minutes too slow, and thanks to that, a whole load of experiments have failed dismally. It's not much use for keeping time anymore, that's for sure. But after being used in so many alchemical experiments, it seems to have gained some understanding of the basic makeup and functional principles of the world. Maybe it's gone some sort of miraculous transformation. Why don't you take it? Maybe it'll come in handy in your adventures. Maybe it will! Yeah! Earth and water, wind and fire, craft me for what I desire. Okay. I don't have an, I don't have anything for this. Okay. I think that's like kind of later in the game. All right, Blanche, what do you got? Hey there, we have quality goods at honest prices. I'd like to ask you about something. I'm listening. What makes Mondstadt General Goods special? Our shop may be spawn, uh, spawn. What? Our shop may be small, but we do have a warehouse in the Leeway Harbor. We take pride in having the largest catalog of items and the fastest shipping in all of Mondstadt. Uh, I'd like to ask about something. I'm listening. What is Mondstadt known for? Mondstadt is a city known for its wines. Taverns are where you'd want to go. Most dwellers here go for one of the taverns for a drink after a hard day's work. You can meet all sorts of people in taverns at night. Okay, remind me to go to the taverns at night then. Alright, that's this whole section done for. I think this is the bulk of the city. At least I'm 90% sure. Ooh, wait, is that a book? Taking that. Hi, is there something <coughs> I can do for you? <coughs> Are you good? I'm <coughs> making a wish. Just toss the coin <coughs> the pool like this. <coughs> And make a wish. You must be <coughs> sincere and do it every day for the fountain fairy to hear you. <coughs> I'm sorry, I can't stop coughing. What do you want? It's like, what are you wishing for? Well, I've been. <coughs> on, I gotta stop coughing. I feel like I'm gonna puke for a long time. I wish that the fountain fairy could help me cough, cough, get better. So I can stop cough, being a burden to my parents, and cough, brother Anthony. I, I honestly hope she gets better. All right, Norma. What's up, Norma? Mm, what's wrong? What are you doing? Oh, I was just on my way to buy some food. Not groceries, though. I was going to get some restaurant takeout and bring it home with me. My husband has long since grown tired of my cooking. You're a traveler. How delightful. I've heard that over in Leeway, they have such a wide variety of different dishes that they've had to split into several different cuisines. I would love to visit it if I ever had the chance. By the way, in case you guys are wondering... I would have pronounced Leeway like Layu, but I've known better because I've heard all my friends say Leeway and not Layu. But, you know, there's an alternate reality where I said, oh, let's go to Layu, and then I get flamed in the comments for being stupid. Oh, this guy seems important. This is Fatui territory. You Fatui? Ahem. The Goth Grand Hotel has been reserved for Fatui delegation alone. No access for unauthorized persons. How long have you been standing there? You trying to get me to abandon my post? Surely you don't think I'm falling for that. Loyal Luke never abandons his post. I must keep watch over the, ahem, diplomatic mission. Ahem. Almost let a slip there. Anyway, don't lo no loitering for loitering? No loitering for unauthorized persons. So get out of here. All right, buddy. I'll get out of that. I'll scramble. 
Yeah, take that. Ooh, there's the side gate, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> or the side exit, right? Where is the side exit he was talking about then? Like a side gate where the sword would be, right? Yeah. I mean, I suppose I'll find it eventually. Hey, Sansa, what's up? Perfect timing. Listen to this. Goo goo. Oh, good. Good evening. La la ladies. I'm not even gonna try and sing this. I still can't do it. As long as it's a performance, my stammer just gets out of control. Stammer? I'm practicing for my first ever performance, but I'm so nervous. I can speak fine normally, but as soon as I'm aware that I'm performing, I get all tense and tongue-tied. I've always dreamed of doing this. I've got to keep trying. Tell me more about your dream. My parents were extremely resistant to the idea of me being a bard. They said there'd be no job security whatsoever. They were hoping I might be an academic, but my research skills are dire. There were days where they'd lock me in my room and force me to study. The only joy I got was from hearing the bard sing outside the window. That got me interested, and then after I grew up, I just wanted to be a bard. Even that meant failing, falling out with my parents, I had to give it a try. This is the path I've chosen, and I'll find a way around any obstacles in my way. Even the stammer. I know I can do it. Hell yeah you can, Sansa! I can do this. Yeah! Hip hip huzzah! What's these guys deal right here? Porthos and Athos. I don't know why. Oh, wait, can I enter? Yo! Okay, I was like, that's awesome. Hold on. Alright, let's see what's inside. Oh, I know exactly how this place smells. Whoa! Hell yeah. Why <laughs> rat? Hello, how may I help? What is this place? The main hall of the Knights of Favonius' headquarters. Please keep noise to a minimum. Please wipe your shoes before entering the library to avoid any dust or dirt inside. Okay. Wow. Viewpoint. Ooh! So, what are... Wait, hold on. What? Huh. I don't know where... I don't know where... Would it be in travel log? Oh, this is all of my... Oh, these are my quests! Ooh, did you just feel the elements of the world? Huh? It's a bit rude to say that about the power... I can change my dialogue retroactively. Okay, so maybe it does matter. Like, I can change it back. Okay, so maybe the dialogue does matter. Okay. Geography? It is! Okay. Oh, wow. I've been missing out on all of these this whole time. I should go back then for those little, like, snapshot moments. I never realized I was missing out on those this whole time. You know, I'm not much of a reader. I mean, despite, being, despite me being a writer and wanting to write books, I don't read that much. I mean, I do, like, I do read. Like, I like, enjoy reading. I just don't read books that much. But... Despite that, I love, like, the aesthetic of libraries. Like, just think about all the, like... I'll talk to that girl later. But just think about, like, all of the words and perspectives and stories that are just painting the walls of this, like, library right here. Not only is that fascinating in real life, but that's just so impressive from a world-building or, like, game design standpoint. That, like, I'm collecting all of these books right now that most people will never read. I will read all of these one day. Mark my damn words. Like, I can, once I start completing some of these book sets, I can, like, oh, yeah, reading the entire Fox in the Dandelion Sea Saga. The whole Hex and Hound Saga. Wow. So much lore I'm just getting here. Oh, these are the library rules. I mean, yeah, I know what library rules are. I don't think I need to read these. Let's take Drunkard's Tale. I think that's all of the books right now. I'll see. Oh, I see some. I see some glowing right there. Okay, I think. I think that's everything. Oh, wait, no, Marlon. There's a glycerin pile right here. I missed this shelf. Let's take these. Yeah, okay, let's talk to this Ella Musk. Yeah! What the hell? Come again? Hmm? Oh, sorry, I was off in my own world. That was Hilaturlian for hello there. Have you eaten? Why does it sound so hostile? 
Are you questioning my academic credentials? Huh. Well, I suppose that's not unusual. Hilatorian linguistics is severely underdeveloped as an academic discipline, so I still have lots of questions regarding the exact meaning of certain words. The biggest gap in Hilatorian linguistics is fieldwork. If I had the chance to communicate face-to-face -face with a Hilatoral, I would shed light on so many burning questions. It's just... It's just what? <sighs> it's difficult to find anyone who would ever dare to approach a Hilatoral, let alone try to talk to them. If somebody could test out my theories on my behalf, that would be great. I could do that for you. I mean, that unusual Hilatoral beat my ass last episode. <laughs> which is even funnier, because apparently that's a rare encounter. And he spawns in different parts around the map, that that one, the unusual Hilatoral. So apparently that was like a super <laughs> rare opportunity. And I just completely fumbled. That's I, I'll never forget that. I'll never forget nor forgive myself oh can i not go up here all right so that's this whole location filled out jeez i feel like i've been exploring monster like i feel like the the amount of time it took me to go through monstat i feel like i've lived in monstat that's crazy there's a little thing up there can i access it <laughs> like you see what i'm talking about right that's like that waypoint thing right let's go get it yeah there's one up there oh i think i unlock that later yeah i think i unlock it later because there's no way i'm supposed to climb up there and get it Oh, a chest! Oh, it's a little dog! Yo, what's up, man? Is he gonna follow me? No, he won't. Okay. Ellen. Do you need something? Sorry, I'm all sweaty. It's fine. So you're with the Knights of Favonius? Who, me? You think I have what it takes? Really? Yeah, woohoo! My training must be really working out after all. Actually, I'm not a knight yet, but I'm confident I will make it through the tryouts. Then I'm going to climb the ranks to captain that get promoted to Master Jean's second in command. Then when Jean gets to retirement age, she'll shake my hand and say, Whoops, I'm getting ahead of myself. Anyway, watch this space because I'm going to outdo my feckless father by a long way, that's for sure. I hope you succeed. Thank you. I will definitely make it, just like the Dawn Knight from the Ballads of the Squire. Have you read this book? I finish it so many times. If you got the time, you should definitely give it a read. Nice. You know, I'm thinking... Uh, if I missed out on dialogue options in the past, that'll just give me more items? I hope so. Like, I really want to, like, that's, a, that's very interesting to me. Alright, there ain't nothing on the other side, so I think once we get up here, we're gonna talk to Amber? Whoa, it is kind of pretty up here. That's gorgeous! Got Sister Grace, Saeed, Monroe, Susie. Alright, let's see what Amber wants. So, the present I want to give you is a wind glider. A wind glider? Outriders use them to ride the wind, and the people of Mondstadt love using them too. I brought you here to give it to you so you can experience it right away. Oh, you're really excited about these wind gliders, huh? Well, that's because the wind is the heart and soul of Mondstadt. Uh, alrighty then, enough talk. Let's give it a whirl. It's easy to use, but you still need to pay attention to my instructions. Dangerous, proceed carefully. Okay, press W to move forward. And use space on mid-air to glide. Whoa! Whoa! This is cool! Watch out, watch out! That's sick. The sky. Oh no. Oh shit! Standing there amidst the wind. It's awesome. Your 
fall with the power of a thousand winds. Now, concentrate. See yourself grasping the wind. Harness its energy. Whoa! I am just butt blasting Storm Terror right now. Okay. Uh, go away! He ain't fighting back. He's really just taking it like a champ. Which is good because I'm low on health right now. So. <laughs> Screenshot worthy thing right there. I don't know how to screenshot in this game yet. Someone please tell me in the comments. Whoa, this is gorgeous though. Uh, are you hurt? <gasps> she got a bad though. <laughs> You've actually got the power to go up against the dragon. Are you a new ally? Or a new storm. I know this is Kaya, by the way. <laughs> I know who this guy is. All right. Storm Terror is attacking Mondstadt itself. Kaya, Traveler, you've come at the right time. We must. Hold on, Amber. Are you perhaps forgetting to introduce us? Oh, right. This is Kaya, our cavalry captain. These two are travelers from afar. Oh, you're not gonna from say our names. Afar. Is that all we know of them? Uh, long story short. I see. <laughs> okay. Welcome to Mondstadt. Uh, though you haven't arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. I understand the anguish of being separated from family. I'm not really sure why you're looking for the Animo God. Oh, but everyone has their secrets, right? <laughs> Relax. I won't press you for more. First and foremost, on behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I would like to extend our thanks to you for your help just now. Well, we could just leave the situation to fester. Your fight to defend the city against the dragon just now was witnessed by no small number of citizens. The acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius is also very interested in meeting you, and formally invites you both to our headquarters. While the dragon's attacking the city? Dressing room. Collect unique wind gliders and... Okay, this... I unlocked character costumes. All right. I hate to leave y'all in suspense, but I'm going to end this episode here because a lot of it was spent in Mondstadt, which, damn, the moment I explore Mondstadt and get emotionally attached to the city, it's in peril and a dragon's attacking it. So, yeah. So, yeah. Once again, thank you guys so much for all the love on the last video and the support on the last video. That literally means the entire goddamn world to me. And thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to leave a like. And if you didn't, feel free to dislike. I won't take it personally. And I'll catch you guys next time when we'll hopefully take down Storm Terror? Wind Terror? Whatever his name is. I'll catch you guys then. Stay awesome. Bum,